Okay, hey guys, we're back with episode 2 of uh, the Minecraft exploration. So we're gonna go right back into when we left off the last day, which was trapped in a small room with the creeper outside. Oh, he's still there. So as you guys can, as you guys can, oh, I can't talk now. Uh, as you guys can see, there's a creeper outside and there's a new texture pack. I got the Doku's uh, texture pack installed and uh, what's this? What is this? Oh, I see. Let's put it on. Whoa. Oh, that doesn't look good. Take it off. Hmm. I uh, see. So now, how do I get outside without getting killed? Uh. Break this open. Where did he go? Huh. Well, okay. I think he's gone now. Yay, he died. Awesome. Yep. Nope, he's still up there. Jeez. Let's just run away for now. I don't want to get killed. So yeah, I got this texture pack because I saw it on the Minecraft forum and I'm gonna I'm probably just gonna link it down in the description so you guys can go click it and download it if you want. It it really does look good. Especially the um the workbenches and when when I'll finally build a house, probably this episode. I'm gonna make it look like really good. What I want to do is make a floating house, so I want to suspend it off a cliff. So there's like very little chance that zombies can like be on top of my house. But the first, the first thing I want to I want to deal with is finding coal as fast as I can because if I can put all the torches down during the night time, then there's a good chance the zombies will not spawn close to my house, and then I'll be a lot safer in the house and probably have access going down into the mines and start you know showing you guys all the different things you can collect from the mines uh, all the different uh, all the different uh, items you can make in the game with stone with steel and probably items from the monsters from the zombies which I cannot kill right now Okay, so let's just start digging into this one. Generally, when you want to go and find coal, the best place is to go and dig underground because this is really a very small chance that you'll find coal outside in the open because it is a rare, uh, a rare resource that you can only have so much of a chance of finding. Uh, but yeah, I don't want to get killed by that guy, so I want to be careful. Okay, so now I'll make I'll make like three no four three pickaxes, stone ones, and then a shovel. One, two, put that one here. And then I'm gonna need the shovel. Okay, get this one, put it down, and now I wanna I wanna run away now. Ugh. Okay. So now he's not gonna follow me again, I hope. Ugh, Minecraft's lagging again. Let's see if I can find any coal at all in this very, very dark space that I just went into. So yeah, if you're going down into this kind of sort of like space, you should be careful because zombies can spawn in where there's darkness. It doesn't matter if it's daylight outside, as long as there's darkness where you're where you're in. Like if you're in a tunnel and then uh, zombies spawn, is because it's dark inside the tunnel you're digging in. It's not because of like you know, oh, it's nighttime outside, so they started spawning. No, it's because you was in a very dark 
dark area and then you allow the zombies to spawn. Uh, by the way, um, when you kill when you kill uh, a zombie, it drops this like uh, oops. it drops uh, the feather, and if you put feather with a stick, and I believe it's uh, what's it called? Uh, I'm forgetting the name, uh, but it's it's the item you can get from mining. Uh, uh, Ah, f I'm, I keep forgetting the names. It's um, it's gravel. There we go. When you when you when you when you when you're farming gravel, you have like a 25-ish percent chance of getting a different a different resource from it. And with that resource, if you put it on tip, that that actually makes arrows for your bow. And I'll probably get into how you make a bow later on when I actually have a sword and want to go fight spiders in the night time. But that's probably going to be a few days after this one. But what I want to go and do now is get as close uh, to a mountain as possible and start digging in the face of the mountain and see if I can find any, um, any, any coal so I can survive in the night. So this is this is the gravel I was talking about, and you have uh, a, a small chance of getting. Uh, I think it's flint. Is that is that the one? I think that's what it called. Uh, can't really mem remember the exact name of it, but um, as you can see, it's like a really small chance you can find it. But if you find it, you can you can make uh, a few a few really good items from it. Uh, you can make uh, you can make like a uh, a lighter you can make uh, what's it called oh there it is found it so this is flint and you can use flint feathers and the stick and you make arrows uh, there's only one other way you can find arrows and that's if when you when you kill zombie uh, not, not, not zombies the skeletons they have a chance of dropping uh, arrows and then you can use the arrows as ammo for your bow the bow doesn't, when you make a bow and don't have any arrows in your inventory, it doesn't fire, it just sits there randomly, it doesn't, it doesn't have any features unlocked, if, if you want to use that word for it. So let's go around the cliff and see if I can spot any coal, which I really need at this point, because I don't want to finish the second day of Minecraft and not have any coal at all. That's really bad. Oh, I can see some. Just look where I'm pointing now. It's up all the way up. Uh, okay, so I'll just go for that one that's right there. I just gotta climb up. Climb up like this. Am I close? No, just a bit more. Okay, there we go. Now that should be enough. I want to block off... Uh, the entire walkway so when uh, when the coal drops down is not gonna fall all the way down no, I don't have enough damn it I'll use I'll just use this why not it's useless anyway I mean it's not really useless you can probably make something out of it but I have no idea if you can or not and there we go, that's coal. Finally have some. Uh, I can't see anything now. Uh, that probably means I'm close to a cave, although I don't want to find one right now. Because that probably means zombies as well. And those are probably going to kill me. So I don't want to find any. Okay, now I have five pieces of coal, which is probably enough for what I need. Uh, you can make... I forget exactly how many, but I think you can make... F oh. Duh! I missed. And here's some more coal. Great. I didn't even have to go all the way up. Well, anyway. It's best that I, I found as much as I possibly could. That's why I don't want to make a house soon in the game because I can find resources and uh, if I make a house far from where the resources are then I'm gonna feel really bad because I didn't make the house where the resources were 
But now that I found plenty of coal, this is gonna last me a few days, at least a few days, actually. Um, that's pretty much it. I just gotta go now and build a house fast before the zombies come in and kill me. But since I have uh, I have uh, the items that let me build build um, torches, even if I'm outside in the night time, they won't spawn exactly where I am, which is well. I'm at least a little bit safer than I was before, so, you know, it's not all bad. Let's just dig up some dirt and use that for a house, and then, when I, whoa, I don't want to jump down. Oh, that's not good. Uh, well, I guess I'm gonna make the house now, fast, in like a few minutes, and hope I don't get killed before I make it. I'll make it like this. This is probably gonna be good enough. Uh, I'm gonna make it like this, like this, 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 and this. Okay. Now, block it off. Okay. Uh, I'm probably gonna use stone to finish it off and hope I don't get killed before I. Wait, actually, this is not good. Make one. Now you put you put the coal and then put sticks underneath it and you make torches. I can only make sixteen because that's that's just how much I have now. And yay! Now I have light and I won't get killed. I hope I won't. Dying is not fun. Because when you die, you go all the way back to the spawn, like I said in the first episode. And what that means is Well, you're just gonna have to go all the way back and I'm gonna get lost on the way back plus you lose all your items they drop down and uh, let's just say if you drop all your items and then you can't get them back because you can't find your way back uh, well you lost all the items and that's not good that's not good at all so I'm gonna make a wall fast oh that's not good Enemies can also drop down, so I want to make a roof in in a few seconds. But first, I wanna I wanna uh, get rid of that block, which I just did. Okay, there we go. Now we're safe because I have light in my house, so there's no chance of any enemies spawning inside. Although I want to keep one one small space so I can see outside. And since I'm off the ground, I'm pretty much safe from any from any enemies spawning, like uh, spawning there and jumping in. This is good. Well, this is gonna be pretty much uh, the boring part of the episode where I'm sitting inside my house crafting items and all that. So, if you guys don't want to see it, you can I guess just click off the episode now. But I, I, wa I want to say this now, I really appreciate everybody that comments, uh, thumbs up the video, you know, subscribes, it's really good for me because, you know, all that, getting subscribers, people watching my videos, it's good motivation for me to continue making videos. Okay, so now I want to back, back, there we go. I want to put this one down and uh, see what I can make. Okay. Well, I have. I should probably turn this into wooden planks again. There we go. Eight. Okay, sixty twenty-seven. I want to put the twenty-seven bill like this. Make sticks. I'll have fifty. Yeah, there we go. Fifty. And now, hmm, what else do I need? I got pickaxes, I want to make a shovel next. So it's this, and putting putting two shovels, because they break faster than, uh, faster than, uh, than what's called, than a pickaxe. Oh, shh, the spider's annoying me now. I'll make a pick at an axe so I can go and get some more wood when I'm finished. 
Um, what else would I need? I guess. I guess I could show you how you make arrows if I'm showing you guys this anyway. So you put one stick in the middle. You get uh, where's where's the okay there we go. You put one flint and then when you put the feathers below it, bang there you go. You get four arrows from each uh, each flint stick and feather you put in the crafting box. So then I'm gonna take those and put them down. So now I have six arrows. I'm probably gonna want to make a few, just a few more, since you know there's nothing I can do with those items now anyway. So I'm just gonna make like ten arrows and keep them in in my box. Actually, box. That's that's another good idea. Uh, if you click on this one and you get your wooden planks and put them just like you did with the furnace, like around like this one, two, three, four, five, yes. And then you make a chest, and what the chest does is, as you imagine, it's a place where you can store your items. And when you click on it, you have a lot of inventory spaces added, and you can keep your items safe. So if you die, there's always they're always going to be inside your chest in the house. So if you ever lose your items, that's where you want to go, back to the chest. I'm going to put... Uh, the sulfur, that's uh, the item that only creepers drop when they die. Well, it's gunpowder, basically. What it does is you can combine it with sand and you can make TNT. And TNT is C4, explosives. And, uh, well, I guess there isn't really that much of a use for it except blowing stuff up. But it's very dangerous because you can kill yourself with uh, TNT, and I wouldn't really recommend it because you can kill yourself, and that's not good. That's not good at all. But when when daylight comes around, I guess I'm gonna dig up in uh, through my roof and uh, start going down into the mines because I have enough coal and torches to last me finding some more coal because this seems like a good area for materials. Well, that's, that's going to be all in this episode, guys. Thank you for watching, and I'm going to see you guys next time.